goes, no way, I'm going to eat this thing into the box. The thing just charged at me. This isn't the first time lifeguards have extracted a rat from a skate bowl. Hey, I've just got a phone call and, yeah, there's a um, rat up in the bowl, so I might throw on some gloves and do a bit of a Steve Irwin up there. A rat in a skater bowl? No. I saw it in the manual. It's a pretty big scene up here. There's people everywhere, so we're going to come up. And if it's not too vicious, we'll try and catch it, throw on a pair of gloves and do our dirty work. You can't believe the cops are here dealing with it. Yeah, it's a bit, a bit, diff a bit different saving a rat than a human. It's most probably going to be harder. When I get to the skate bowl, the coppers are doing nothing. So I was kind of like, it's a rat. Like, I'll do it. Like, who cares? Drop in, Jess. <laughs> Why did I drop into the bowl with no shoes on? That's just plain old Jesse just doing things before he thinks. I wasn't going to touch it. <laughs> I was going to near it. I just held the bucket behind it and just slid straight in. Job done. How easy was that? <laughs> as soon as I looked at it, it was just eye contact and it's just like, bang, let's go. And I was kind of like, whoa. I didn't think rats were vicious. Oh, my God! That was so funny. <laughs> What's the dance, man? I'll go with myself. Definitely I knew it wasn't my jacket. As if I'd use my jacket to put on a rat. <laughs> fully jumped on my face. <laughs> So funny. If you had it in the bucket and it jumped and you hit it again, it was like, <laughs> <laughs> It's not even my jacket, I just put it on, so. <laughs> it's probably mine. No name. Oh, hang on. Chris Chapman. <laughs> Chapman. <laughs> the Lifeguards Operations Manual is a very important book, but I definitely don't think there's anything about catching rats out of a bowl at the skate park. Rat rescue. I need to wash your jacket, chat. <laughs> <laughs> not happy, yeah? No, not happy. Eight rounds. Harrison has been tasked with pest control duties. So I was just on the promenade and a couple of the uh, young skater kids came down saying there was a rat in the skate bowl. This isn't the first time lifeguards have extracted a rat from a skate bowl. When Jesse attempted to catch an unwelcome visitor, <laughs> the rat turned the tables on him. Today, it's Harrison's turn. Lifeguard versus rodent. I jumped in thinking I was six foot tall and bulletproof. That quickly changed. <laughs> Thing just charged at me. How am I gonna get this now? You know, I'm eating humble pie, got my tail between my legs. And I'm just thinking, oh, there's no way I'm going to eat this thing into the box. <laughs> One of the other grommets ran down and put the lid on it for me, so I didn't have to have any close contact with it, and I still look like a hero. Frank. Bondi rat Frank lives another day, and brave Harrison shows how it's done. You know, where Jesse went wrong is he let his guard down and he didn't get one of the other kids to do it for him. 